you know, I've heard some pretty wild things when it comes to men who have cheated and tried to get their woman back. But this one, Lord have mercy, is uh, all bad. Now, ladies, what would you do if you caught your man cheating only for him to turn around and say, baby, it was a mistake. Then he asked you to marry him. Oof. <laughs> and that is what we are jumping in right here, building healthy relationships. Frankie Rowe in the building. We may not always tell you what you want to hear, but we will definitely keep it 100. So go ahead and get in with that post. So the post starts off by saying this weekend, I found out my dude cheated on me for the third time. <laughs> when I confronted him, he came with the same. I'm sorry. I made a mistake type of drama that he did the last two times. Then the next day, he comes to my house begging for forgiveness and wanting to get married. Hmm. I can't even lie. I love him. And I said, yes. Oh, no. But now I'm feeling stupid and not sure what I should do. I mean, I mean, I mean, what, what, I'll, I'll let you take this one. Have you have you ever experienced either yourself or uh, another friend? going through the cheating game and they come back and they want to get they want to play the marry I want to marry you what are your thoughts there personally no first off second um yes I've I've known a few people a few women to uh be engaged in that type of foolishness because it is foolishness um where he runs out and do his thing and then he gets caught up cheating mm. and then he plays the oh baby let's get married you know trying to smooth things over because he knows that's what she wants so basically he comes with this I got you know, this this lame excuse for cheating then turns it into baby let's get married because he done got, got caught cheating he's not even serious about getting married that's just to throw her off and keep her you know her focus off of the fact that this fool out here running the streets being a thought mm. Tell us how you really feel about it. I just told you. <laughs> this one def definitely just reeks of being desperate to get married. And when I say desperate to get married, I do mean desperate to get married. Mm -hmm. We're talking about a, a trifecta of cheating. Right. A man who has cheated not once, not twice, but three times. Thrice. And you... <laughs> are so desperate to get married that you thought it would be a good idea to say yes. Love is is a wonderful thing and, and I get the fact that you did say that you were you you loved him but I mean it, it just really depends on uh you know where you want to go with this. Like for example, um are you okay being in an open marriage if if, if that's what it boils down to because that that's what is going to pretty much be like if he hasn't got his cheating right under control you will just go from being the girlfriend that he's cheating on and honey there are many women out here who can testify that this will transition to you being the wife mm -hmm. that he is cheating on yeah because you know if, if he's not, if, I, I do get what you're saying he he may be going there um just to try to throw her off but maybe and i'm talking about maybe lottery pick maybe maybe th the third time is what it took to, to set him straight no. will, will you give him that give him that shot that it was a third no. time it was a third time that really made him turn around no they don't need to get married they need to go to counseling and if she is going to, to stay with him if she really wants to stay with him knowing that he already cheats, knowing that he already being a D-O-double-G, then you need to go to counseling ASAP. Don't accept no ring from him at all. Don't accept no engagements, no proposals, no baby, let's do this. Nope, nope, no, no, no. Y'all need to go to counseling first and figure this entire thing out because clearly brother man is either not happy with you or n not happy, you know, overall because he keeps cheating. Yeah, I mean, it, it sounds like Monogamy may not be his forte, mm -mm. to say the least. But, I mean, only you know what your heart wants. And sometimes the heart is stupid. <laughs> Period. I was going to say the heart wants what it wants. But you have to check yourself at the door. Because, once again, you've got two options. Either this time is going to be the last time probably not or he's going to be a reformed man and it'll be all good